Alright, what's up ladies and gentlemen, it's Super here and welcome back to another MKX video. And no, this is not Deja Vu. Uh, ironically enough, this is literally the guy who I played uh, the first match with in the last MKX video that you guys saw, which was Scorpion. That's funny, man. I can't believe we got the same dude. I played versus like six other people during that video and then right as I... It's Sub-Zero's turn. I get this dude. Alright, hold on. <laughs> How do you do his moves again? I played this game for seven years, but I was... I didn't take him into training mode or anything like that, so... I remember how the game went when uh, I played this dude. Oh, I was going for a take throw. Shit. Pick throws, nice. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, there you go. Yeah, like I said, it might look a little ugly for the first game or two, but I'll remember. Two. I'll remember. Fight. Oh! Lock. Should I slide? Fuck it. Now let's do it. Ooh, the cyclone. Oh, that's smart. He wants to put me in the corner. Too late. I got a lot of meter here. I hope I didn't like Oh yes. Oh you know you're dead, right? You know you are dead, sir. Woo! Down three tick throw. I actually wanted to do back three tick throw. Now that one is really hard to deal with because, of course, you get the uh, back three three follow up. And you either, you know, if you try to jump out the way, that second back three is going to hit you. But I got it with the tick throw. And I was able to close it out with the two bars. The benefit of having meter. All right. That first game looked kind of ugly, but, you know, we pulled it off there at the end. Let's go with that classic Sub-Zero. The Icicle Arms. Watch out, man. That's Frostbite. One blow of the wind, and those arms are getting sliced. All right, hold on. What else do I use with fucking <laughs> this character? Release the damn, that Ferritor uh, alternate is sick. That golden red? God damn. It's been a while since I've actually like used or played Ferritor. That's a, that's a punish well. So he could punish that. Interesting. Oops. <laughs> I was going I was going for it again. Ooh, overhead. Oh, right when I was going to press a button. Hmm, using this variation. Ooh, nice anti. I don't even I don't know when his his shit stops, honestly. Nice. I don't know when his shit stops. I'm normally used to playing the other variation. I haven't played this variation in the longest. The delay wake up fucked up my timing on my attack. Could poke out of that. Fuck it, 
why not? Okay, he did it too. I'll take the trade for now. Oh! Missed the anti -air. Shit. That traded. That traded. Good shit. That is one thing you can do with Ferritor. If you trade with his back one, he could actually combo into another back one. All right, so I'm gonna get my salty run back. Let's see if I could ad adapt here and uh, learn a little bit more of the matchup. Um, I don't know if I should go Cryomancer or if I should go Unbreakable. Let's try it one more time with Cryomancer. Let's try it one more time. If he beats me again and I play him again, then I'll go with Unbreakable. I think the the, the Ice Parry will definitely be good versus this variation because it's more of a brawler variation. I just don't remember where the hell he's coming from. Oh, he picked another one? Oh, okay. Picked the same variation. I thought he picked a different one. Okay. Oh, shit. Ooh, man, that has fucking range. Oh, come on. Okay, double, double armor. Ah, man, I was hoping that I would get the uh, the hammer to come out before, so I get a little bit of meter back. Wait, what the fuck is the forward four move? Two, five, oh, forward four two. I thought I was doing it right. Oh, shit. Oh, I guess that's plus on block. Wow, his, his buttons recover really fast. Slide. I'll take that for now. All right. I was not willing to use up any meter. Interesting, interesting variation for sure. Like I said, it's been a while since I played versus somebody using the variation. Ooh, nice block. Wow, and he was able to dash up first. Okay. Oh my god, I keep fucking... Alright, there you go. Fuck, man. I keep messing up the combo strings of Crowmancer. I keep doing forward 4-1. Four, Ugh. There was a couple of times where I got anti-airs, and instead of, like, capitalizing on my anti-air and actually getting some damage, I kept doing fucking forward 4-1 four, and not doing anything. It's just letting him drop. Ugh. Alright. Alright, so last match here, best 2 out of 3, and I am definitely going to, uh, I'm going to play him with Crowmancer too. I was actually going to switch over to Unbreakable, but I won the match. He kept his variation. I have to keep my variation. It's going to be the last match we play. You know, I want to give other people, or I want to get some variety, I just say. But this guy's pretty good with this variation. Damn. 
that's not punishable? It seems like this character is safe on everything. That was a great call on his part because he knew that I was going to respect his pokes. Damn, he could react to that? So it just like completely negates the uh, projectile. Ooh, wow. Impressive. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Dropping my combos, man. The rust with Sub Zero is really fucking me up. Final round. Fight. Yeah, that's a good punish on that. Keep it simple, fuck it. A down one, but his command grab came out before. Good shit, man. There was some cool stuff that we saw right there. This motherfucker could actually do three repetitions of that one combo string into itself. I never even knew that. That's pretty cool, man. But yeah, my rust with with this fucking my rust with Crowmancer Sub Zero really, really fucking hurt during that match. There were so many times where I could have gotten damage. I left that shit on the table because I just fucking confused myself with what combo string to do, what combos to do. But I'm not going to use that as an excuse. He deserves it. Good shit. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to retire my Crowmancer because it was way too rusty for me to continue playing it. So I'm going to just play Unbreakable Sub-Zero. A little bit more basic, you know. I just want to do the aura and I want to do the burst. And that's pretty much it. So here we go. Going up against Raiden. I didn't see what variation of Raiden he's using. Wait, how do you do the aura again? Down back three, right? You reject okay, my good. Aid. I am protector, not you. Earthrealm needs better protection. Round one. Fight. Down four. Just down one into that. Oh shit. Thing has range. Give me in the corner. Ah, oh, shit. Get a breaker in time. Or? Good. 
Wow, I can't believe he respected that. It's, it's plus on block when I have meter burn, but right there, like, that shouldn't have worked. See right there, that's that's something that I can do. This might do it. Not quite. Oh, fuck! Oh, you've got to be kidding me, okay? The fucking... Dude, the blocks to surprise the shit out of me. I started attacking too early. There's no reason... If you block a back two by Raiden, there's literally zero reason why you should rush attacking. So I wanted to... Obviously, I was going to punish with back one too, but because I started my attack a little bit too early... Only stand two came out. Wow, that was fucking close. Cause once that shit whiffed, it was pretty much neutral. Got lucky, hit him with the down one and, or down four, and then that was it. Cause I was gonna chip him out. Good stuff. All right, let's play a couple more matches here with Sub Zero. Let's see what costume do I want to use. Let's use a Revenant costume. I haven't used that. Wait, did I use it? I think I used it in the first match, right? Fuck it. Let's use it again. Let's show off that pale skin we got. Actually, it's not really pale. It's fucking gray. Let's show off that gray skin we got with the nice slick back. All right, who are we fighting against? Kitana. Kitana, the princess. Unbreakable Sub-Zero, I think, is a lot of fun to play. I, I, I definitely think the other two variations are better. Don't get me wrong, but this variation is pretty fun to play. It's just... The other ones do what they're supposed to do more, like, or better, I should say. Like this one, you could get damage with the meter burn slide when you have R up, but a Crown Master, you get way more damage. And then defense wise, Grandmaster is the way to go. Oh, I didn't think that was going to punish, actually. That's a lot of pushback. Take those trades if I can. Oh shit. See, that's where I was fucking up on. I was doing a forward 4 1 when I was playing. Shit. When I was playing uh, versus the other, the other dude. Nice. That's one beautiful thing about the meter burn aura. You could actually combo into pretty much anything you want. Right, there you go. I just committed to it. Fuck it. Why not, right? Give me that ice cube head. That's definitely a prize. It's not often you get a, a prince's head to go inside your fridge. Damn, that sounds fucking morbid as fuck, but I mean, Sub Zero's pretty cold blooded. Alright, here we go. Final match of the video. Oh god, the connection is that bad. It gave me an option to either accept or decline, and I'm like, fuck it, why not, right? Let's fucking accept. We gotta finish it off with the best costume that Sub-Zero has. The action figure. The blue steel, baby. Going up against Jackie. Is this full auto Jackie, or is it another Jackie variation? Round one. Fight. You have this. Okay. Ooh. Oh, 
Oh, it's one of these. Oh, okay. Connection two. Damn. Got the perfect Jackie setup going. <laughs> I'm avoiding it through tea bags. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, God. harder with the connection <laughs> all right we got this Ooh. Ooh. all right hold on ladies and gentlemen Come on, Freezer. Shit. <laughs> of course. Of course he, he fucking rage quit like a piece of shit. Of course that's what he's going to do. Good God. What's this guy's name? By, by Liu 55 I don't know what the hell his name is, but god damn, it's been a while since I ran into a piece of trash like this guy. Holy shit, man. We go from somebody who's very impressive with fucking a variation of Ferritory that I haven't seen in a long ass time to a piece of trash who's still trying to auto Jackie, uh, full auto Jackie spam people with probably the worst connection that I've played against today. This is beyond McDonald's. This is a fucking cave trying to use somebody's Wi-Fi who's thousands of miles away. That's how bad this fucking connection is. Ugh. God, I got like fucking chills on my fucking arm because the connection was so bad. I knew I was going to win the whole time. Don't get me wrong. But having my character be frozen in time, no pun intended, Sub-Zero was getting really frustrating but i knew i was gonna win the whole time there's no way that this guy was ever gonna beat me but if you run into him online tell him what you think and fucking teabag the shit out of him because he deserves it that's it ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for watching today's video and i'll see you guys next time what's going on it's super here and thank you guys so much for watching today's video i hope you enjoyed it if you did and you aren't subscribed already make sure you guys do so and if you want to see some more there's videos popping up on the screen right now. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.